during Young's modulus, a property of the material. We put weights on the end of a long wire and see how much the wire stretches. What you see here is that there is a wire fixed at the bottom of this frame, and the wire goes up to the top of the frame, and at the top there are two pulleys, and it goes over the pulleys and down to a support upon which we can place heavy weights. So they effectively, we have a very long wire. And there is a scales here that can show us how much the wire has stretched as we put more and more weight on the pan hanging from that. We need the length of the wire, and by using a meter stick to measure up to the top and then across over the two pulleys and then down again to where it's clamped, we find that the total length of the wire is 1.9 meters. This is a 1.9 meter length of brass wire. The radius of the wire is 0.285 millimeters. That's 0.285 millimeters for the radius of the brass wire. Before actually making the real measurement, we want to stretch the wire to get the kinks out. Now we won't do a perfect job, but it helps to, to load and unload. So we start with no masses on the pan, and then we put a two kilogram mass on. That stretches the wire some. We put another two, that's a total of four kilograms added. And we put yet another one. So we've added six kilograms to stretch the wire. I take the, these off and do it again. Two, four, six kilograms. And that helps get the kinks out of the wire. We want a straight wire so that we're measuring the stretch of a straight wire, not the uncoiling of a coiled wire. Now we'll actually put masses on and observe the stretch of the wire. At the moment, with no masses added to the pan, I read 0.5 millimeters. With two kilograms, it now reads 2.7 millimeters. With four kilograms, it reads 0. Point, sorry, 3.6 millimeters. With six kilograms, it reads 5.0 millimeters. We'll repeat this two more times for a total of three measurements, just to make sure. Remove all the masses. With zero, I read 0.5 millimeters. With two kilograms, I read 2.7 millimeters. With four kilograms, I read 3.7 millimeters. With six kilograms, I read 5.0 millimeters. One more time. Zero masses, zero kilograms added. 0 0.5 millimeters. Two kilograms. 2.5 millimeters. Four kilograms. 3.9 millimeters. 6 kilograms, 5.0 millimeters. This is the primary data from which you can determine Young's modulus for this material.